Jerry, hi. I haven't seen you for quite some time. Jaina versus Jaina. Okay, another mage. My magic will tear you apart. At least an apprentice this time. Let's try this. I think I want to keep the coin for a shredder. <laughs> wow, it's getting really dark outside. Oh, what a good draw. Could have played it like this, into this. I'll show them. I'll show I feel like it doesn't help too much. No, oh, that's probably better. Very nice missiles, I'm very happy. <laughs> like, what the hell? Okay, so one of these has to be mirror entity, which means I give him a second scientist and a second. Uh, well, not that I had a choice. Wait, okay, it's freeze mate. Okay, it's freeze mate. Um, I think without Chasmistic in the deck, I don't really have a way to deal with the freeze mage efficiently, especially without EJH and stuff in the deck. Hmm. Uh, I think I need a Chasm Mystic for this matchup. Also, the missiles, like, one damage, one mana deal three damage to face. Pretty much wasted. No way to deal with this one either. But at least I have my big minions in no hand. This might help for later. But if he plays Emperor now... Okay. It's a little bit better than I hoped for. <laughs> yeah, he's frozen. Still has 36, 32 life. So many sixes. <laughs> I needed to use second Nova Doomsayer. Oh, there. Why didn't he play this last turn? No, it was like two turns ago. Oh, by the power of Ragnaros. We have some power here. Hmm. This is somewhat interesting. Um, uh, nine, ten, for fifteen, twenty, twenty-one. Like, if I had a fireball, I could at least trigger the ice block. Um, I guess that's good enough. Well, that's pretty good. He isn't even halfway through his deck, which means he... What does he need? He needs Alexstrasza. Oh, okay. 
Okay, this was e easier with these two guys. <laughs> but he would have needed Alex Traza or second ice block and doomsayer, I think. Because there was no way that he cleared both rag and boom. One spell or something? No, not really. You asked for it. Did I just play against this guy? Jomo sounds so familiar. Let's see. Oh yeah. Okay. It's just the same guy. Uh, Still a good start, I guess. I'm a little bit more happy about the su the the early Ragnaros draw again because turn eight Ragnaros is pretty powerful against Freeze Mage. So I remember when I talked about four drops earlier. This is like you want to. This is something you want to do at turn five, four. Uh, or just. Almost this dies to flame strike. All of this. It's not even so good. He has still like two loot hoarders and two mad scientists in there. So mirror entity is not that great overall. But it's still okay. Especially for two. Basically the problem is if I play this now and he just does like coin Nova Doomsayer. I have nothing to play the turn afterwards. What to do? What to do? I'll just pump up the Mana Worm a bit and go face. I need this to refill the board afterwards. Wow, he draws into a lot of his secrets. Oh well, that's even that's, that's even worse for me. Yeah, like I said, I need this to refill the board. I have nothing to do until turn eight with the sand for now. I at least have nine damage of burn. Not even going to do much. Oh, fine, I'll just play this. I have no time for games. So that's nine, that's eighteen. 1827? Hmm. <laughs> Could like <laughs> throw everything at his face. Uh, stupid. What I actually could have done is stolen the um, Thorazan, but wouldn't have changed too much. Getting this hand cheaper doesn't do too much. And I still have the chance of getting something small later on. Although he might make me steal a second Doomsayer, I have to be a little bit cautious. So maybe I should have done it. Wow, that's all of my burst. I burn. Life and <sighs> Okay, the question is if he can kill me with his five cards. Well, I guess we find out, right? Um, I'll steal this because it's the easiest way to Let deal with it. Survive. 
All depends on whether or not he can kill me right now. And I have a counter spell up. So he needs like five burn spells basically. That's not it. My magic will tear you apart. You win. Well played. This rack is quite powerful. <laughs> And he didn't draw well. I mean, he played like two secrets from hand, and he. Well, he, he also played two scientists, to be fair, but. Mm. I'm not sure. Turn, turn 8 or 9, Alex Straza, whatever he played there, was quite okay for him, too. But if he wanted to flame strike this board, I'm not sure what. Like. He had 9 mana, I think? No. No, he had 10. So, I must protect he would have played the flame strike, and then what would he have done with my rag? Like, frost, no, uh, Frostbolt Ice Lands? But then he couldn't have killed me in time, because he was at 1 anyways. I think he would have lost anyways, even if it would, wouldn't have been Counterspell. I'm not sure why he flame strike there. Uh, that's really good. I think I keep... Yeah, I keep this. Hmm. Okay, that's a little bit too fast. But that's a good opening. Because... I can use it on an empty board, he's not going to play anything. Like, on the board. Me going second against him having wild growth is a problem though. Eh, it pumps up the mana worm. Yep. That's a pretty good board turn too. Next turn mirror entity against his five drop, also quite powerful. Can play keeper, oh well. I hoped I could pump up the Mana Worm, but it's still my best play, I guess. Yep. If he plays, like, Druid of the Claw and Taunt, I would have to use this and Frostbolt, and that's about it. So this way I can I develop a low fab. It's also quite good. I, I cannot use any of my spells though, right? Right. So I should probably just trade. These don't die to... Oh, that's good. These don't die to a swipe or something. Um, No way of... No. I can only play these two. I can ping this. But the Lothap has to die, just to preserve all my guys. I have two spells in my hand, so these two are very powerful at the moment. And then I just need one more thing that I can play, and then it's boom time. Worst thing that could happen is probably Sylvanas. Second Wrath. Okay. Not too bad, I suppose. Hmm. <laughs> Stupid. Um. Yep, why not? <laughs> well, at least it didn't matter. But. You didn't. You didn't do a good job, Flame Waker. I suppose that's a good draw. Question is... Ancient of Lore... Heals up to 6 again. I play Boom. Plays Big Game Hunter. 
Eh, I guess it's okay. <laughs> if he doesn't have a lore, he's dead. Oh, maybe he runs an earth and I can see. Well played. I occasionally see this being played in Druid. Earth Ring for? No. Actually I didn't see it being played but being posted, like anti agrarists with earthens. Instead of shades, or at least one. We played this like four seasons ago, I think. Jaina versus oh. Malfurion. I must protect the wild. You asked for it. Uh. <sighs> I think unstable portal is good. Um. I'm not sure if I want to keep. Frostbolt. Just if he plays Zombie Chow. Without minions, it's not good enough. <laughs> eh, well. That's a weird start. Ah! I'm not playing poker, do I? Hmm. Okay, I pretty much. Oh boy. <laughs> Give me something good. Turn three Sunwalker. Seems reasonable. <laughs> they always have it. That's good. I can't play the counter spell as long as he has the coin. I would like to do it next turn just to. I must see. Um, to make his 5 drop awkward, just to make him think, but uh, as long as he has the coin, wasting a fire uh, counter spell into this is pretty bad. Wow, this is all spells. I'm not sure if I want to risk the portal next turn. Depends on what he plays. If I want to kill it with flame cannon, for example. Yeah, I want to. But <laughs> then again, I have to ping, so that's my whole turn. Fine, I'm dealing eight damage to him. That's good enough, right? And he used the coin, so I can develop the counter spell. Some, some when. The Sunwalker was a pretty good portal. It's quite neat also. Golden. Hmm. Six. So maybe Sylvanas. Maybe just Druid of the Claw. I'm not sure what I want to do against... Uh, oh, well I forgot about Parson's discount. <sighs> so I have 8, 11, 12. I can put him down to 10. This doesn't do too much though. I can just... Develop the Sylvanas. Then again, if he has combo in hand, <laughs> I think I'm dead, right? 14, 14 plus 9, 23 plus 6, 29. Yeah, I'm pretty much dead then. Uh, so I kind of have to clear. What do I do against this? Let's see. Big game hunter. Yeah, almost. I can ease your pain. Justice shall prevail. Runs out on me. Was this a good idea at all? Swipe is pretty bad now. I got a random two drum.
You might think I'm setting up a flame strike. This game went so weird without any early game minions. Yeah, there's swipe. And I can't play Sylvanas ping, unfortunately. I can either play Sylvanas and run both into, or play Azure Drake Ping. Oh. That's pretty bad for me. <laughs> we need you two cards, so it's totally possible he got something like a Zombie Chow or a Shade. Zombie Chow would be really bad. But don't have too much to do. I still have two Fireballs on the deck though. Next turn might be Azure Drag Counterspell. He hasn't played a single Innovate yet, so it would be like... Nothing for tempo and a card for a card value wise. Used two spells last turn. Might not have a... Uh, uh oh. Yeah. So it was right of me to play a route combo earlier. It's 14 plus 23. Uh, no Could have sent me to five. <laughs> Rip my board. Now I get so such a slow hand. He has in a way to white growth. The counter spell isn't going to do anything. He just used his most important spells anyways. Hmm. But developing the mad scientist doesn't do anything. I should drag for 4 mana, it's pretty good. That's an interesting turn. 2 4 9. Wow, that's such a bad play if he has swipe. But if I play Sylvanas... Hmm. Oh no, well he would need a second spell plus swipe. I mean if I play Sylvanas he just hits your powers and then I have nothing. So that's one of my few chances to develop my board here again and to finally put some pressure on him. I still have two fireballs left. I still have two, one Azure Drake. I think I played one. Yeah, I played one. But if he has something like Innovate, Swipe... And my board just dies. That's a pretty powerful turn. He has one Keeper left. He played one against my Sunwalker earlier. That's six. Uh, second Savage Raw is a big problem. I have no time for games. It's not getting easier by me not having any more. Uh, 
Um, secrets on the deck. Should be able to steal something now with Sylvanas. If he doesn't have those, the Keeper. But if he has Keeper, he wants to use it on the Slush Belcher anyways. And then he can just hit me for 11, 12. Puts me to 6. At least it seems like he doesn't have Innovator Wild Growth in his hand. Which makes me a little bit more comfortable. <laughs> oh no, I still have a secret in the deck, right? It was just Mirror Entity and Counter Spell. Oh. Okay, this makes it a lot better. But I had to ping this thing away. Otherwise I would have sacrificed the Mad Scientist for sure. Maybe I should have done it just like here because he's likely to trade this. What to do? I would have put more pressure on him. I mean his best play before was to play Azure Drake, Druid of the Claw and charge again into my mirror entity. Okay, his hand is far away from being um, what I would call a nightmare hand for me. Oh, right after the BGH. Um, do I have lethal somehow? I don't think so. Like, not guaranteed. Um, or do I, Wade? Um, let's see. I have three attacks with four guys. Uh, with no, I have three attacks, and I steal a guy. So if I do something like hit, 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 I can steal the sky golem, but I can't kill him right now. But that doesn't matter. I have like two secrets up then, and a Ragnaros, and this. Okay, that's of course. Going to do. Well played. Well played. Right off the the BGH, this sucks for him. Sorry, Tim. I think he can't kill me from here with three cards. One gets counterspelled, one gets copied. There's this Innovate. Oh, so he had a wild growth. Huh. Guess he didn't want to give up on his card draw. I think he can win if he runs like double BGH and I don't know. Taunt. What could I get what screw me over? 